Pahrump Nugget, Progressive Cash Drawings, Mystery Point Multipliers, Mystery Gift Days, Extra Cash for Four of a Kinds, Bingo Bowling Football and Food Specials. Looking for constant action? Look no further. Pahrump Nugget Hotel and Casino. Um, well, uh, apparently uh, uh, Mr. Kohlbarger from the town asked them contour to come before the board and present uh, present what the plan was. Uh, he actually came up and said he was there to answer any questions. Uh, Commissioner Easley had a list of questions that she went through. Um, one, the, one of the most salient points I didn't think he answered was how many projects have they actually completed that are up and running and making money. So I went back on that and asked him that again and the answer was none. Uh, they w did have some trouble with uh, one of their subcontractors who is uh, in trouble in Ohio. Um, and to me, the project, the town approved 187000 to do this initial study. And then phase two was originally was going to be, uh, I believe it was around 800000 They pared that down to 200000 And then with that, what they were asking was, for the state and county to come in and to you know do a special tax district and find money to build this project that they have never completed one uh, that bothers me the idea that uh, a uh, theme park here in Pahrump is going to draw people when they never survived in Vegas uh, they do have the one uh, Circus Circus has still has some rides and stuff there um, uh, I, uh, I made it clear that I'm not in support of continuing with these people and spending money on uh, more studies. One of the other things they that said was... That was even talk in the original time when, when they came before the town board that this business is actually in business just to do studies, that they never completed projects. I mean, there was comments about that, that that is what they do is just do the study. Yeah, I guess. I, I think we could do it without them, but they, uh, they had uh, uh, they done the initial study um, they they want more money, and part of that more money, uh, they said we would have they would have to lobby the uh, state uh, to you know get money. And I asked, is that part of this two hundred thousand? No, that's separate. So they, we're going to have to spend more money on a lobbyist to lobby. It just it just keeps growing into a, uh, some grand project that uh, uh, I don't think fits here. We have a fairgrounds property. For years we've had people work on it. It's been stalled and stalled. Let's put a lawn out there and a parking lot and let's start with that and then we can build from there. And uh, they went before the county commissioners to ask for money, for more money to, for, to continue this? Well they didn't ask us for an amount but it, that's that was ultimately what was going to happen is they they want the county and the state to help fund this project. Um, and I'm, I'm good with uh, private, uh, private government uh, partnerships. Uh, uh, we need to increase uh, the, uh, the infrastructure. We need to get water and sewer and make sure properties uh, are able to be built on. Uh, but, but this project just to me doesn't sound like, uh, uh, like it's going to go anywhere but more studies. So what was the end result of this? Uh, we uh, told them thanks for coming.